Hey Yello and welcome back to Vanilla Plus. I'm MG Rose and I've finished the stairs. Yay! Yeah, they were a pain in bum. I couldn't make up my mind. Couldn't make up my mind. I've added these in. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep them. But I think they look quite good. Just to add in down his little strip mines. Makes them a bit bigger as well. Never mind. Right, but yeah, I want. it took me ages to work out what I wanted to do with this place. I'd swapped and changed my mind about five times. I did get a message from um, our black. Uh, I'll have a look before the end of the episode and I'll tell you exactly what his name was. Saying to use um, clouds as decoration. Well, that's what I put inside these little carpenters panels. I put some chiseled stone at back. Put the carpenters block in. Turned into little half slabs. I did a bit of cyan dye and some plain cloud, like what we used for the jump pad down there. So, well, the landing pad. So, yeah, I think they look pretty cool, actually. I, I was quite um, impressed with that. Yeah, and I've got this deactivated for people so it don't make horrible noises when we stand on it, because it's just there for decoration. Yeah, but that's not what we're doing today, because today we're going to be putting one of the storage rooms together. I have extended the hallway on here for the storage rooms i've done this all the way down to the end which i think looks really cool because the way it ends i just think it looks funky but each and every room i've managed to dig out and i'm now left with an abundance of stone and andesite and diorite and all the rest of it so we need we need to get one of these rooms decorated out kitted out and ready to go for all our stuff to go into so i am going to attempt to make it so we can just place stuff in a chest here and have it going into the ja uh, barrels and stuff but first we're going to line out the room together we're going to lay it out together i'm going to put the roofing in first because i want i only want there to be one jabber barrel going around the middle all the way around in three groups of threes, like it shows in the dia, dia um, yeah, diorite, in the diorite ones. And then what I want to do is put on the floor underneath them an overflow one facing upwards, like nope, not like that, like that, like that. So we'll have one like in the middle row and one laying flat in the floor. I think that'll, I think that'll go quite well. Anyway, while I get cracking with this, how are you guys? I hope you're all super, super cool and fine and having, well, you change over, having a super fantastic day. Um, I'm absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Um, just a bit tired. A bit tired. But that's the curse of not sleeping, isn't it, I suppose? I'll be fine, though. I'm just enjoying enjoying my time my free time my space my peace and quiet as a mum we don't get much of that these days <laughs> um so yeah just waiting on my little girl's um story to go out in her book they've all bought and paid for now at copies of the book so looking forward to giving them to family members a little book of our boo stories Right, where did I put, which backpack did I put my hammer in? I don't need all this in my hot bar just yet, do I? I'm not ready for this lot yet, I'll leave that like that though. Um, yeah, a little booze, but I keep calling her little, she's not little, and she, she'd kick my backside if she heard me calling her little. That's how I know she's not watching the videos that she says she watches, it's funny. <laughs> Because nine times out of ten I've called her a little girl and she's never once questioned me about it. But she would if I did it in front of her. <laughs> right, get these on. Yeah, I am... We are going to start the new um, schedule on as of next week. So, as of next week, Vanilla Plus will be going to Tuesdays with a live stream from half past eight people. So... Some days it might be a little bit later, it might be about 9 o'clock, it all depends. But like for the first hour we'll have Abu joining us in moderation. So, as a moderator, should I say, not in moderation. Mm -hmm. See, see, still early, still early, I've only just got back from school run. <laughs> right, so yeah, that's that, right. 
but I want it repeating down here. Um, are they stairs? I think they are, aren't they? Yep. Bummer. Oh, wrong one. Wrong one. That one. Actually, do I need it? There? No, I don't need it there. I need it there. But I need it turning, that one, actually. Because I want this wall hiding. I want that wall hiding because the outside wall is nothing to do with what's going on inside. So we want it hiding. That's going to have um, another wall going up through it, so don't worry about that one too much, the little spacey bits. But because we are, what we're, what we're technically doing is we're trying to aim to make it so we can hide all of the um, hopper hop stuff these things, the hopper ducks and all that lot because um, I just don't like it I don't like the way it looks that's why I, I think that's why I never got into redstone because redstone's just too it's complicated yeah but it's too messy <coughs> oh, I'm sorry about that no I really am yeah it's just too messy so I don't like using it right because what I want um, I've got to try and work it out now how it works right I'll tell you what I will, I will work it out off camera once we've done the walls and the decoration and all that jazz all that jazz I probably won't want that one there so I'll take that out now um, right because I will have to use the uh, do -do 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 -do, what they're called I can never remember or well, I might not have to actually Oh, micro blocks, that's what I was thinking. I, might, I thought I might have to use the micro box panel, but I might be able to make that work going all the way around. Hmm. We'll see, we'll see. We'll give it like that. I'm going to have to break one of these anyway so I can get in, but I'll do that more like at the entrance way, not where we're going to put all the jabber barrels and stuff. Um. Ah. Uh. That's going to need to be a sideward stair. It's going to need to be a sideward stair. And yeah, um, uh, I forgot what I was going to say now. I was going to say something about the new schedule and stuff like that. Oh yeah, that's the one. Right, as I was saying about Vanilla Plus moving to Tuesdays and having the full day dedicated to it with a live stream to finish the day off. Um, I will also be doing that for our um, Mod Source 2, which will be a new series for you guys. Um, which is a um, SMB server, so it should be cool. Um, should be, should be really cool. I've been having loads of fun already on there. The other dude that I'm online on there with is such a laugh. Really, it just makes the whole game play a lot better doesn't it playing with someone else and um, we're currently just setting everything up i've got myself a ton load of projects on there so there'll be plenty of stuff to do for you guys absolute plenty the piece to the resistance is already done though um it's just epic i love it it's it to be honest it is one of the first things i well the first thing apart from my witch's tower which will stay standing as one of my favorite builds but this one's quickly knocking it off its perch. It's knocking it off that number one perch because I love that build. It is absolutely epic. Um, and to say that I managed to pull it off so early on in the game, it was just absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. I was so chuffed with myself. <laughs> yeah. So you'll get to see that when we go over to do the mod source our mod source server when we go over there and join Lounsey over there and um, why did I just pull that one out I don't know I don't know right uh, do 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 like no like that like that yeah that um, the mod source ones will be on Thursday I don't know if I said that I can't remember if I said that I'm just a bit all gibberish it's morning isn't it I'm all gibberish anyway but bit more old gibberish on the morning um yeah so we'll have mod sauce on the thursday wednesdays are definitely gonna stick to being design tech it's one pack I, I don't think i'll stop playing i love that pack so much so that i've set myself up a ridiculously large challenge 
of doing the county town. Um, what else? About? What else am I adding? Something I've not actually put in the description for the channel yet. Uh, do, do, do. I will be adding. I don't. I can't remember if I said this to you guys. I think I did. I think it's just design tech that I haven't talked to you guys about it. In. Um, but yeah, I will be adding a creative series. Not quite yet. Not quite yet. I just want to get a few, few plans in line and a few things sorted first. I think that'll look all right the way that is. We'll put these in as temporary blocks behind just so I can put the hoppers in. Just because they're easy enough to break out these things. Um, yeah, so the creative, what I will probably do is I will pick something that I think is from a fantasy theme that matches the biome. As well as if I find a biome that matches a mod perfectly, I will do a build matching that mod that goes with that mod kind of thing if that makes any sense to you guys so like for Britannia um because i will use the mod source mod pack because it's got more variety of different mods in it out of all the other ones that i've been using so i will use that one but like for example like we'll have Britannia. just i would probably do like a bit great big greenhouse with giant flowers at either side of it with all the setup inside that um all working around that so just silly little things like that and like the for um, not farmcraft one because i haven't thought about like like for the um i think it's another magic one and that uh, really dark and dingy magic ones i do you know, like the really like sinister ones shall i say we could do like a um evil like crazy alchemist kind of place and that with it which i think would look really cool as well but yeah i'm just rambling now i'm just rambling right i'm sure i brought more than that over i made another backpack when i went back over to the farmhouse as well because i am rapidly running out of inventory here hmm yeah see i knew i had I knew i had I spent absolutely ages getting bits and bats made together so I didn't have to bring stupid amounts of resources over just the thing that we need. Obviously I will have to go back and get a lot more but we've got trees growing. We've got trees growing. Did I not? No I didn't. Did I lose my head if it weren't screwed on these days? It really would. There we go. Like that. And then we'd have the hopper duck, the filtered hoppers, another hopper, a hopper duck. Oh, I don't think it's going to work having a month four. Hmm. I think what I might do is just have them on the floor for the ones that are going to contain stone. I think so. Like, actually, no, I know what I'm doing blooming wrong. I don't want them in the floor at all. I've worked this out completely wrong. My head's. See, too early. It's too early, people. Right, where's them compacting drawers gone? They're already in my hot bag, in the invent down here, look. These are the ones that I wanted for the stone ones. Um, well, cobblestone. I'll put two in. I'll put one there and one there for the cobblestone. Because this is literally only going to be stone items in this room. I don't, really, I don't think I actually said that to you guys. I don't think I told you. But it's literally only going to be stone items that go in here, but each different form of the stone item. So like smooth stone, um, chisel stuff. I just need to double check I've got this right size. Because we'll have cobblestone, stone, cobblestone and stone. One, two, three. How many is the from chisel for them? Um, I think I may have done this room a bit too small. Let's see, where did I put my chisel? Where did I put it? Here it is. Oh, and I've gone and chuck it away. See? Right. Oh, I haven't even got any stone on me. Do you know? <laughs> this is going very well today, isn't it? Very well. Right. There we go. There we go. Right. Stone. Have I got any cobblestone on me? Probably not, because I've been using my silk touch pick, haven't I? Let's have a look in this one. Let's have a look. Come on, open. 
Um, no. Right. What other one could I have possibly put it in? This is me though, there's no, no organisation. If there's gonna be a some, there's gonna be some in one of these backpacks. I can't believe, right, all this stone, but no cobblestone. Right, where's my other pickaxe? We'll make some cobblestone, I think. Just so we can see, because I'm gonna have to use, um, I'm gonna have to put each of the blocks in first just so I can set out where everything's going, so. I know there's a ton load of stone all around us and stuff, but I don't want to dig that out yet. I'm not there yet. Not at that point yet. Right, well I've got all the cobblestone. I've got some cobblestone, should I say. And I've counted out. And I have made the room. Two, I think. Two blocks in that direction. And two blocks in that direction. Just short. So I'm going to extend it four blocks backwards. And then I will get all the hopper ducks and stuff set up and then I will come back to you guys once I've got it all ready to decorate really. So I will see you in a second. Toodle pip. Well welcome back. I've managed to get all the um, hopper duck thingies in with all the hoppers all behind and it works. Look, got things I think they should still be. Yep, stone's coming in still. And we're coming in through there, so I've managed to do it. I've sussed it. <laughs> right, <laughs> little celebration over. Let's get, we'll get some of them. We'll get some of them. No, uh, why am I Do you know, playing so many different mod packs, you don't have to get cute, confused with what you're supposed to be doing. It's like I put the um, compactor in, didn't I? No, well, they don't work in this mod pack. It's the others that I'm playing with. We don't shift click to get out of here either. <laughs> right, so I want to put the mossy into these little corner bits, just in the corner bits, maybe a couple of these along here as we go, but for now, just in the corner bits, and possibly a couple along the bottom as well, don't know about that corner bit though, we'll leave that one for now. We'll leave that one for now. It's easier to get into that that corner than it is the others. Right, what else now I wanted to do was to put these in. The cracked one will come become part of it, but just not yet. And that's gonna go in last when I just wanna when I get the look of it. Because it's a stone room, it's all got to be stone in here. Um yeah, I'm not too keen on the Done. Oh, that's not going to work. Um, I forgot about that corner. Oh no, lost glowstone. Lost me glowstone. Never mind. Never mind. Right, where did I put that one? There. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see. Because it is all going to be this, you see. All the walls, apart from the floor. I'm going to make the floor look pretty cool. But yeah. Um, I can't remember what we were talking about before I left. It's been quite a while since I um, left you guys to crack on with this because these hopper duck things didn't want to play a ball. Well, what a pain in the backside they are. You know, where I can, I'd prefer to stick to pipes and other systems for getting them out thinking a bit like this so don't want too many don't want too many just the odd couple splattered here and there a bit like that yeah and then that'll do Put one in there one in there and then keep going so yeah, I think that will do actually, yeah, we don't want no more, that, I, I quite like the mossy stone being in the corner actually, that can stay there, don't really want to add no more to that, just put a couple of these in, hmm. chuck them all in, well I know, I, I, I think I did remember, do remember um, saying that I was planning on doing a um, creative season soon, and that I wanted it wanted to do it 
a little bit differently and do it all of, themed off either the mods or like a fantasy theme around the biome that I find. Well, the first one I'm, I'll be doing is one that my um, nephew has requested. He's asked if I will do a um, castle kind of bit fit build for him. Well, I don't like the old castle idea, um, but I'm going to do a bit of a castle with a difference. Bit of a castle with a difference, so should be fun. Should be fun. I'm use um, a few different materials that I don't normally use much of. So yeah, I'll be looking forward to that when I get started. Just need to work it out, plan it out. So yep, um, what I will need though is for more ideas to come in, more requests, and I actually really like that. Yeah, just some more ideas, some more requests from you guys for after the castle's finished. Or like themes, whether it's an individual idea that you've got that you want to see, or whether it's just a theme that you want to see. How much cobble have we got? Hmm. Possibly. No. I'm going to stick with smooth stone ones. Going to stick with the smooth stone ones. We've got plenty of them. Got plenty of them. Right. Oops. Not shift click. Do you know? Sorry about this episode, guys. You've got morning, Jane, and I'm not really the most um, efficient of people in the morning. I'm. Well. To say it quite plainly, I'm a bit dippy in the morning, to be honest with you. A bit dippy, a bit docile, a bit all over the place. But I get there. Get the job done eventually. Eventually. I'm just, I'm just trying these, because I'm not sure I'll keep them, but... No, I've done that wrong, haven't I? Yes, I have. I'm not sure I'm keeping them, because I'm thinking I might want to keep it quite plain, actually. And just have the odd little little touches of detail here and there. Possibly put one there if I'm going to put them in. Mm. I don't know. I'm sorry if these gritty bits are hurting your eyes. You're from the carpenters. The whole see-through aspect of it. But I'm sorry. We will get them covered up as soon as we can. As soon as we can. Um, uh, let's see what these look like. Yeah, no, possibly. You guys like to let me know what you guys think when we've finished. Because, to be honest with you, I'm not too sure. Not too sure at all. So, I'll leave that one. Final decision down to you guys. Oh, um, I did say I'd come back with um, the bloke's name who commented to me. Um, but I've completely forgot, so I'll just get this roof in, then I'll cut off for a minute, and then I will go find out, and then when I come back, I will tell you. So, <laughs> I'm sorry, my memory is absolutely atrocious. I'm quite surprised I actually remembered to then about telling you. Um, yeah, unfortunately, I wasn't able to reply to him, um, as there's no, what they called, the reply button thingy underneath the comments. There's none of that for me to be able to reply, so... Yep, we've done the cloud idea. I have got other ideas for adding cloud decorations. I can't get that through there. Got other ideas of adding cloud decorations and stuff. So, yeah, and thank you for the lovely comment. It was absolutely great. So, I will get round to finding your name out again. In just a minute. Right, I'll pause now while I'm thinking about that. I'll find your name. Um, why I couldn't remember it, I don't know. It's Black Dracon, if that's how it's pronounced they ain't super cool if it's not I am really sorry oh no I can't push them in they're already in them mm. alright so yeah it was Black Drake on who left the lovely message so thank you love thank you Um, right I don't want them in there I want it to stand out a little bit more on there I've decided that one can stay that one can stay but I've decided I want these moving out I hate getting things out of the carpenter's box because they just fly everywhere but Never mind, I don't mind losing some stone, as you can tell. We got plenty, and it's still filling up. Bloody Nora. Just means I can make more chisel stuff, and then it's all there ready, so that when I do want to 
work out how I want something to look and I am planning on using stone then I can just come in and have a look so I have done it like this I've done it and I'm gonna do all the other rooms the same um, but I've done it like this just so we can get a better idea of what the blocks look like a bit better because the, the images are a bit small when you are chiseling them so it's nice to have them all there where you can just walk past and go oh I like that one or oh that one might fit in there you know what I mean? It just makes it a little bit easier. Right, um, which ones did I pick up? I'm thinking I might change my mind on that one. Um, no, it might be a bit too busy, actually. Maybe a bit too busy. That's not going to connect up, is it? That'll be a problem. That'll be a problem because it'll be obviously non not connected. Maybe. Let's try that one. Let's try that one. This is one that I have intentions of using on the flooring. But we'll try it for the roof as well. See whether that's alright. Because we can add a bit of dye to add a bit of a um, different colour and texture to it going through. So it's not too bad really. I love being able to add dye into the carpenter's box. It is the easiest and most simple way of just adding that extra little bit of detail when no other blocks go with the block you're using. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I think that might be too busy. Kind of. Mm, I think it's too busy. I think it's way too busy. Let's try. Let's try one more thing. If not, I'm going to turn it into one plain wall and I will leave the decision up to you guys. Whether you're watching at home or whether you're one of my pests sat in my house, you can tell me what to do with it. Right, like that. I don't like decorating ceilings because it always looks too busy to me. Hmm. No, I'm going to put it back to just these plain blocks and I will let you guys decide what kind of detail to put on. Just for now, because in between now and next Tuesday when the next episode will be out, what I'm going to do is go... Do you remember the underneath of our... Oops. Farm, um, farm area where we've just finished working on. Well, what I want to do in there is go under and grab all the stone and cobblestone that we've got in there out and bring it all up here which is why i made that extra backpack as well because we're gonna need we're gonna need a lot a lot of storage if i don't want to have to keep doing too many trips backwards and forwards so we'll get all that lot moved in here now it's got its own permanent home because eventually i do want that place to just become redundant really um make underneath there so we don't need it because I want to get the like an alchemy tower done for potion brewing and portals and stuff like that I also want to do the lumber house for the tree farms and things there's the train, train system as well that I want to do I've not decided whether I'm going to do it on land underground or in the air I'm thinking in the air because I found out there's elevator tracks in this, isn't there? Of some sort in Railcraft. So I'm thinking we may do a skyline train system, which I think will look pretty cool. And that's when we'll definitely make some use out of the clouds. Right. I think that's looking pretty cool. So I don't want it looking too smooth or too patterned. So I might just use the smaller bricks. Let's put that one away a minute. Put these lot away. Clear my, clear my palette so I can see what I'm doing. Because I can't see them once, properly once they're in this little small bar. In our little hot bar. Because the do they just look too dinky. You can't see the detail on. Thinking that one. Or that one. Or maybe a mix if the white. If they're same diff. Let's have a look actually. Not like that. Like that. I'll get there eventually. And I'm sorry. This is going to take forever isn't it. Me faffing about. Uh, and then put a couple of them in. I don't actually think that looks too bad, really. I just don't want too many of these ones. So we'll just scatter them about. 
scatter them about. Don't want them looking too uniformed or anything of the sort, which is really difficult, especially for me. I like things to be. I, I'm quite um, quite fussy. Things don't look right to me unless they're neat and tidy. But sometimes, sometimes you just can't do perfectly neat and tidy, can you? Oops, oops, a daisy yet again. Well, I am hoping to see you all next week. Join us at the live stream. It'd be nice to see, nice to see some names pop up and have a few chats with you all. It would be absolutely lovely. Um, and this is why I'm going to start streaming from all my series. It's just because I want to get to know the people that are watching. Um, I'm not an ignorant person. I enjoy talking to people, getting to know people. Well, why did I do that? So, I do want to get to know you guys a little bit more if you're watching. So, it would be nice to have you all join me on the stream. And I know I've probably said it would be nice about a million times, but it would be. It'd be pretty cool, actually. It'd be pretty cool for me. Um, uh, I think I think I mentioned my daughter will be moderating as well as my next door neighbour. So. And you'll have not only me, but two other lovely lovely ladies to talk to. Right, I quite like that, but... Hmm... I don't know. I may change this whole floor out into slabs, you know. Or maybe that. Well, I don't know. We can... Let me know. Floor slabs are like this, or roof turned into slabs, or left like that. I think the slabs are slightly lighter, aren't they? So, let me know. Let me know in the comments down at the bottom. And I shall have a look into changing it. I think I may add a few decorations from um, DecoCraft in here. Just to give the floor a bit more detailing between episodes. Because the Deco bench is right the way over at the farm. And I really don't have the time to do that and I want to get cracking with some more rooms just copying them out doing the same thing just with a different brick basically or well, block not brick I will show you them all at the beginning of each episode so don't worry well for now this this is all done this is all done so if you have liked please well sorry not if you have liked if you do like this please do leave a like if not let us know what can be changed what can't be, what you think should be just taken out completely and we will see what we can come up with together well thanks for watching don't forget to follow me on twitch and twitter and then you're never going to miss the, sh the new streams from vanilla plus or any of the others or our videos or anything else and obviously subscribe so you get the feed straight from youtube too thanks a lot for watching i've been mg rose you've all been absolute total and utter superstars as usual Thank you and bye.